Diseases Chapter 2A, B and C What are infectious diseases? A disease is a condition in which your body or a part of your body is not able to function properly. Diseases can be spread from one person to another are called infectious diseases. Infectious diseases are caused by tiny living things called germs. Germs enter our body and make us ill. These germs can be passed on from one person to another, spreading the disease. A non-infectious disease is caused by germs and cannot be spread from one person to another. Can animals get infectious diseases? Animals can also get infectious diseases. These diseases can spread from one animal to another. Some infectious diseases can also spread from animals to humans. This may lead to an outbreak when the disease spreads rapidly, affecting a lot of people. Infectious diseases such as bird flu can spread from one bird to another. It can even spread from birds to humans. Now, do you think the plants can get infectious diseases? Yes, plants can also have infectious diseases. The infectious diseases can spread from one plant to another. They can affect the health of the plant, causing it to lose leaves, drop or even die. Some examples of infectious plants are leaf rust, stem rust, and white mold. Example, a rose plant with healthy leaves and a rose plant with leaf rust. Medicines. Why do we need medicines? Medicines help us to treat the diseases. Medicines are usually prescribed by a doctor. Different medicines are used to treat different illnesses. Some medicines help to relieve fever or pain. Other medicines help to treat cough or runny nose. Some creams help to soothe the itchy skin. Medicines come in different forms, such as tablets, liquids, and powders. We can also buy some medicines at pharmacy. How can we use medicines safely? All medicines come with instructions. It is important to read and follow these instructions. Medicines can be dangerous if you take too much of them. An adult or a trained doctor, nurse or pharmacist will let you know the correct amount or dose of the medicine you should take. Use a dosing cup or oral syringe to measure doses in milliliters. Spoons cannot measure medicine accurately as they come in different sizes. You must never take someone else's medicines because it may make you more ill. Vaccines what are vaccines? Our body is able to protect us from many germs. However, sometimes our body cannot fight off some types of germs and they make us very sick. When your body is protected against a disease, you are said to have immunity against it. Vaccines give us immunity against many diseases. It can protect us from the disease for a long time. Vaccination also helps stop diseases from spreading. This can help prevent outbreaks.
smallpox in the past people did not know the cause of many diseases people would die from diseases such as smallpox are there vaccines for animals vaccines can also help prevent diseases in animals pets and farm animals are given vaccines to keep them healthy this can also help to prevent the spread of disease to other animals as well as to the people this reduces the risk of an outbreak now how can we prevent the spread of a disease an epidemic is the spread of a disease that affects a large number of people within a community when the disease spreads worldwide it's known as a pandemic practice worksheet an infectious disease can only spread from one animal to another this is false because an infectious disease can also spread from one animal to a human and not just animals medicines can be used to treat diseases it's true we should take the correct amount of medicine true vaccines are given only to people not animals false vaccines are there for people as well as animals